Hi there. I'm back for a thought for Thursday. So um, I just wanted to say that today was a day we're starting a brand new year, 2022. And I just thought I wanted to start it off by saying thank you. Thank you. Thank you to all the educators out there, the good, the bad, and the ugly, because they all exist, right? I'm talking teachers, principals, paras, superintendents, cafeteria staff, librarians, counselors, you name it. If you work in the school, I thank you, including the janitor. All of these positions I mentioned are ones that have participated and contributed to educating each one of us and our children. Okay, they have taught us over the years about finances, history, body image, cleaning, self-care, etc. They are an extension of our household. So I want to say thank you. All of us have gone through education. We've all graced the hallways of our schools, um, elementary, junior, and high, and have had very different challenges depending on the generation in which we've gone, right? The challenges in the last couple of years have really made a tremendous impact to us all. However, in my opinion, our children have paid a price and the teachers continue to fight to try to educate these students and fight for the things that are right for them. Um, we can all admit that primary education sets the foundation of life, right? If we don't have enough, if we're not educated enough, if we don't have enough information poured into our little ones, then the opportunity for them to be successful is not out of reach, but becomes harder for them to accomplish. So again, thank you for showing up because you don't have to. Thank you for trying, even though it's very difficult and it's hard to want to continue. Thank you for diligently working to help the students and having to manage your own at home. Thank you for putting up with all of us complaining about how bad the process is and how bad education is. And regardless of us complaining or sending in our suggestions or trying to help and support, you still show up. And so I thank you. I thank you for that. But now I want to encourage everybody else here to thank a teacher. Thank your child's teacher. Thank your child's paras. I believe the paras are awesome. I've had a para in my child's life, you know, all the way through his, um, through his education career. And I have to say, those, the ones that I was fortunate to have, have made such a significant impact in his life and mine that that is one of the reasons why I feel as though the right people, the right teacher, the right para has an opportunity to do some really, really great things. And I thank you. So now I want you to, I encourage all of you to thank, thank your teachers. Here's a thought. In order to contribute and participate to the health and well-being of every child, we have to be willing to give a solution, provide help, and support where necessary. That doesn't mean that they're always going to take our, our request. That doesn't mean they're always going to be on our right side. But I just want to say that it's really important for us to say, if we're going to be upset about how they're doing things, can we at least provide a solution to how they may be able to do it better or to be able to support your household in a way that may be a little bit different from someone else's? I don't know. Just ask. But now the thought is, Today, we're going to ask, I'm asking you to please help me in thanking all of the educators that have made it very possible for our children to get a little glimmer of education during this horrific time, during this pandemic, because the pandemic, let's face it, is not gone away yet. We're still having to overcome those challenges. And so for that, understand those people, those teachers, that extension to your household, I want to say thank you. So if you can do me a favor, and I can't wait to engage with you, is that if you can drop below, tag a teacher that you found awesome in your life, whether it's your child's life or your life, one that you see goes above and beyond or should be recognized for the greatness that they do, please tag them below. Thank them because this is the day and time. We're in January. We're starting everything new. 2020 can be a great and glorious time as long as we lock arms and do it together because we are in this together. And I want you to be able to contribute and participate to 
with your extension of your family. So again, I thank each and every one of you, even the ones that have been very, very mean to me. I thank you all, and I hope that you're able to do the same. I look forward to being able to thank your teachers too, your teachers, your superintendents, your parents, your, your, all of your professionals in your school. Thank you, and you have a great and glorious day.